Yeah, what's going on everybody? It's Hot Pocket Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. I'm checking in from a little bit of NBA 2K12 today. Um, it's basically another developer insight. This is number six, which is called the training camp. Now, um, I've already done two. Um, I talked a little bit about my player mode, which I was ecstatic about. Um, also, the new play calling system that 2K12 has brung. Um, I just want to give a big shout out to the developers of this game. They doing one thing right now. And, and that's getting my attention now let me get you guys attention real fast all right they have a new training camp um it's something like practice mode but it's it's on a whole nother level basically let me tell you like this during the development these guys came out with a way to how should i say make you better at the game if you're a beginner and a veteran now, when I mean veteran, I mean people that have been playing 2K series over the years. Now, for all you guys that are beginners that are just going to get your feet wet within this game, this is also good for you to pick up ways on how to do certain moves that us vets know how to do already. Now, for all my veterans out there, just become better at the game. You know what I'm saying? Show your moves. Now, this is what they did. They made a feedback system. You know, so every time you do a move, it gives you the certain feedback on what move you did, what move it, it thinks you're going to do, and, you know, anticipates which way you need to go on doing those particular moves. Now, let's get into the, you know, the training camp on what the lessons are. They have about nine lessons. Um, they have jump shots, layups and dunks, triple threat. Um, if you don't know what triple threat is, jab, step, pre-dribble, you know, protect, you know, dribble launches. Dribble moves, post offense, post defense, off ball offense, and on ball defense, and passing and offense. That's basically like giving alley oops, giving goals, and stuff like that. Now, one thing that they did bring to this game is mentors. Now, when I mean mentors, I don't mean you know somebody that you actually look up to, I mean they actually have mentors in the game teaching that particular player or of course the user how to do certain moves so say you know you're doing a shooting drill you'll be doing it with kobe bryant but of course he will be training with michael jordan now of course for the post moves you would be using the white but hakeem olajuwon would be teaching you now um what they did was the mentor's role in the training camp is the following show you how to do each move provide you additional tips so you know it can make you better when you're doing a competitive play and challenge you to a test after each lesson so every time you learn your moves you got to do it against the computer that already knows the moves now learning the moves are particularly easy some say it might be hard you know if you don't know to actually i mean the actual button config but they say that when the training begins the mentor will show you the move during this you will see a controller on the screen basically as he's demonstrating it you'll see how it mimics his movements how you know he mastered it and how you're supposed to do it with the controller in your hand now one is the button and stick is required to do all the highlighted shows that that you know in the step-by-step -step description in the command so basically like instead of a button just being pressed they actually read it off to you on the screen which is pretty cool um, I really probably won't need this, but I'm just doing this for you guys. <laughs> All right, now the controller graphic is really helpful, you know, because it's visual feedback, like I said before. And the hat, like, uh, like say you want to move it in a half circle, and with the left stick, you know, you'll notice that the mentor moves the stick in that direction, like, so it's very helpful to show you and you know get it from start to end and stuff like that. But you know, if you if you run into a couple moves that are difficult. What the mentor is going to do is give you more and more pointers. So, for instance, if you fail, the mentor is going to give you a tip to steer you in the right direction, which means, you know, maybe you're pushing the stick too soon or too early, or maybe you're not holding a particular trigger, or, you know, you flat out just not listening. <laughs> like, that, that's crazy, but, it, you know, what can you do? Now, um, what's going to happen is at any point during the training, you can ask the mentor, you know, yo, show me this move again. Maybe you didn't pick it up the first time. Maybe you want to, you know, do it over. Now, the last thing is the moves challenge. You know, of course, I said after each lesson, the mentor will make sure that you remember everything that he taught you. So basically, you know, what if you le learned all the post moves with Hakeem and everything? Now, you have to challenge him into a one on one game. And, you know, it gives you a certain amount of seconds each move. And, you know, in order you have to meet like a certain requirement to pass. 
So if you don't, if you don't, you know, accumulate enough points, of course you fail. But you know, they say he will take it easy or he won't. You know, I, I don't know. I don't know. You know, if if it changes from if you playing on Hall of Fame or if you playing on Pro. So I really don't know. Now, um, that should sum up the video. You know, um, if you want to read up on it, the link will be in the description. Also, I want to thank uh, Chase Money for providing me with this beat. Um, I want to give a shout out to Game Face Studios. I want to give a shout out to my man Wise Now for becoming partner and getting that background. Um, also, Chase Money, you already know what it is, man. Welcome to Machinima Respawn and, of course, a partnership. So, um, you guys, I'm going to holler at y'all later and peace.